I try to do videos for YouTube every Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday about 2 p.m. That's when I try to release them. Uh, unfortunately, with the weather changing and everything, uh, nothing's been biting. I haven't really been catching much, so it's hard to keep up with that schedule. So, and today is Tuesday, so this video should be coming out tomorrow for Wednesday. But uh, I haven't been catching anything, so I'm not sure if I will. Uh, I was planning on going to my uh, storm drain there where I usually go, but somebody else is fishing in there right now, which is unusual. Usually I'm the only one, so maybe they've seen my videos. But uh, yeah, so now I'm trying a different spot for a while. And I just, I don't know if there's gonna be any fish around here. I guess I'm gonna need to start uh, coming up with some different content, you know? Start doing tackle box breaks like John B or uh, do some instructional stuff. I keep seeing people fishing with their spinning rods like this, so uh, maybe I'll do something on that. If you're watching this video, you should know better than that by now, but I keep seeing it around here. I'll have to go, uh, my dad went fishing the other day down at the coast and found a rod, and it was a bait casting rod with a spinning reel stuck on it, and they... Uh, they forced it on there so much it was literally stuck. It would not budge off. And the rod was snapped off. And I guess they got mad because they got snagged on something and snapped off the rod and threw it down. And the reel broke off right about there. So it is a pretty common thing to be an idiot. Okay, I'm not sure how this is going to come out. Uh, I only brought one GoPro with me. And... This guy just pulled a total dick move a minute ago. I was walking up to the storm drain where I usually fish. I, the guy who was fishing there moved. So I went and got in my car, moved, parked over there, and was walking across the bridge to get to it. And there was a guy fishing on the bridge who wasn't there earlier. When I started to move, he, just, he got there after I was parking. And he walks out onto the bridge and was fishing. Figure, you know, that's fine. He's fishing on the bridge. I'm going to the storm drain. No problem. He sees me coming and knows exactly where I'm going. There's only one other place to go fishing over there. So he knows exactly where I'm going. And he starts smiling and laughing and grabs his gear and runs over to the storm drain and starts fishing. It's like, dude, you are a I just walked like a hundred yards to get there and you take off running and take the spot from me. Like, you knew exactly where I was going. If you wanted to be there, why were you not already there? And then on top of that, whenever I'm going, I'm getting back in my car to move somewhere else, I drop my GoPro, so it stops working. So not only did that guy take my spot, but he owes me a new GoPro. All right, let's see if I can get to that spot without somebody snaking it from me this time. Not that there'd be anything left in here, because it's already been, I'm already the third person in the last hour to be fishing in here. That's a fish. Pulling drag, man. There's a little one, too. I lost my Senko, but that was worth it. Ugh. Not a bad one, probably a pound. Let's just see. At least now I got a video to post. One point three four. A little heavier than I thought he was going to be. Yeah, the sun's out there. Alright. Am I still recording? Yeah.
There we go. And that's going to be it for me. i got to be somewhere. So, uh, that was a fun little fight. I don't think I've ever had one that small pull drag on me like that. But maybe it's because I had my drag set pretty loose. <laughs>